Welcome to the channel everyone, my name is Ryan and we are playing RimWorld today. This is the Fallen Jedi Temple and here we are focused in on Loser, the most important colonist. No, not really, he's just he's just one of many. He doesn't even have a shirt on right now either. What's going on with you, Loser? Why are you walking around with your chest hanging out? You guys see that? He's got a little bitty patch of bare chest hanging out. Uh, let's see what we've got going on at the uh, tailoring bench. Oh, so we definitely need some shirts. Wait, don't I have some set up? Yeah, we do. Okay, so Rico's got some set to work. What are you up to these days, Rico? Making pants. That's beautiful. So he's working on the first one. Yeah, let's let him just finish. He's just naturally going to go about it. Uh, loser's been walking around without a shirt probably for years, so I'm sure he'll be fine for another couple weeks. Let's see. Oh. We do have um, a colonist idol. Myrtle, what are you doing? Oh, do I just need to pick a research or something? Yeah, I need research project. What happened there? Uh, did we finish up our robotics? Uh, maybe I didn't hit the button last time. Yeah, because I remember this is what we've been aiming for. Because once we get this level researched, I'm going to start building. Uh, some hauling bots for starters, and I'll probably work on crafting next. So I think I just didn't click it, didn't click it last time. All right, Myrtle, get to work. You've got stuff to do now. Anyway, things are going pretty good around here. My mechanoid is still missing a part, but no worries. Oh, we've got some, yeah, we've got some bionics to install. Hold your horses, everybody. Let's go ahead and get those set up. Now I've got a heart, a, a leg, two legs, and a stomach. Let's go through, um... Yeah, let's just start at the front here with Defiant and see if anybody... I think... I feel like somebody's missing a stomach. But let's also look for leg injuries. Um, nobody should have any scars because I do have this thing here, the Regenerator. And yeah, let me turn that on. Yeah, so people have the ability to just come in here, get their scars uh, cured and stuff. But doesn't they can't get their full limbs regrown. So let's take a quick peek through our entire colonist and their health here we should probably also do this do this with the needs tab as well i've been i haven't done that and sometimes there are little things which will be bothering a colonist that you can fix very easily you know so it's worth going through it occasionally um let me keep looking here though okay right ear router i'm not i'm not worried about your ear router no nah, but we should get that replaced um if I don't have anybody who's missing a leg, what I'll do is I'll do something like I'll give V a uh, a left leg. You know what I'm saying? So she's got two of them. Allow her to move much quicker. Let's do left leg. I'm going to suspend it, though, just in case there is somebody who needs that more. But we also have the advanced ones, so we'll see. Who are we on right now? Buck? That's not important. Okay, so, yep. Got a lot of cortical stacks here. Wait, did I go back through it already? All right, I think we did. We went through the whole list. Everybody's do pretty much whole, except for, uh, what's his name, Router's ear. Oh, okay, here's the stomach. I knew we had somebody. Awesome. Well, guess what, bud? You get you yourself, Zapper. I remember you from the prison. You took forever to get recruited. Uh, let's get your stomach here. Let's get that installed. Beautiful. Also, I should go make him that. Oh, we got somebody who needs to be copied over to our biphasic schedule. It seems to be working pretty well. We haven't had many uh, mental breaks and stuff, but that's, you know, I think also due to the fact that the colony is running pretty smoothly. But the biphasic definitely helps. So anyway, I've got a heart and I do have an advanced bionic leg to give to somebody here. Deck, what are you up? Why are you good? Uh, trigger happy depressive, 53. Bio. This guy's got some decent stuff already on him. I feel like maybe I should give this guy the heart, to be honest. Because he's 53, you know, if he has a heart attack or something, that would kind of stink. And let's look at his bio. Yeah, he's decent. Construction, mining, good quality uh, warrior and stuff. Yeah, trigger happy. The only downside is he's depressive, but hey, can't have everything in life. Let's give him the heart install. Bionic heart, beautiful. And we've still got one advanced leg. So 
Who are we going to give that to? Let me look here. I'm going to go through again, see if I can't find somebody else who's just got a single leg. And we'll give it to them. All right. Well, this is a good choice here. I think Gizmo actually has a left leg, but not a right leg. So let's get that advanced bionic leg on the right hand side beautiful beautiful she is of course our main crafter she's not our specialist we don't with our ideology in case you guys haven't seen it in a while or have never seen it just tuning in we have no specialists available with our ideology except of course for the leader and the moral guide but nothing else that was by choice you know i've tried to make the ideology more challenging so we are pacifists too which er, it, it can have a big impact on their uh, mood if they get a neg they will get a negative thirty moodlet if they uh, kill somebody who is like in co even if they're in combat they do not enjoy killing at all. But uh, well, hey, I said we could go through and look at some of the needs. Maybe it's not a bad idea. Let's see here. Okay, those are standard. That's there's nothing we can do about these right now. Let's see here, disturb sleep, uh, just outdoor. Oh, this person must be a, uh, yeah, an indoorsman or something, or an undergrounder. Yep, okay, no worries then. Let's keep looking here. Supreme, genetic pessimism, chemical starvation, jealous of Lynn's bedroom. Who is this? Who is this person? Jimmy D. Well, 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 Jimmy D, the troublemaker. Tell you what, if you're jealous of Lynn's bedroom, Show me where Lynn's bedroom is and I'll change it. It's yours. All right, let's give this to Jimmy. And, oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, unassign, reassign. Beautiful. Lynn, you're left to find your own bed now. Now, Jimmy, where are you at here? What else did you need? Now, he should be... Okay, so he... Well... Hold on a second. He is chemical fascination, so... I should probably sort out his drug policy here. Let's see. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. There he is. Uh, social drugs. Yeah, I think I need to edit. I might be able to go to unrestricted. Is this the one that allows him to use Yayo, Flake, and Psych IT and stuff? Okay, I think that'll work for him. Yeah, I've got this one set up for the wasters, but I think it'll work for people who have chemical fascinations as well. So, okay, yeah, this one's on, router's on unrestricted, so he's the waster. And, yep, that's good. I don't see anybody else. Uh, Zapper, wait, what is Zapper? Oh, he's having surgery, that's right. Why is he on, a, is he also a waster? Yes, he is, okay, okay. So it looks like we're good now. I think uh, we, we solved Jimmy D's problems. That's why I think it's good to go through the needs tab. So let's keep going. <gasps> Up and, and, okay, so this person does not have a bed. Oh, and they don't like clothing. <laughs> this person's a nudist. Aim, yes, this was another named colonist too, by the way. So nudist trigger happy, pretty sweet. I, I would, if this was like a desert or a jungle or a more, you know, hospitable climate, I would allow this person to go nudist. But uh, sadly, they're just going to have to, you know, deal with the clothing. But we will get this person a bedroom. In fact, let me go ahead and just assign it to her. I don't know why she hasn't already taken it there's there's some available maybe this is like the first time she's seen them or something <laughs> i don't know let's keep going through though so that should pretty much take care of her obviously the stuff we can control so let's keep going uh tortured artist disturb sleep nothing uh, sky high expectations genetic pessimism chemical one who is this router you're good he's on the right i know he's on the right thing we just looked at that Hey, without a table, mm, you know what? Maybe I can solve that. Hold on. I've got an idea. Because we probably could use a table down in this location. There it is. That's what I'm looking for. Just like right here. Nothing fancy. How much wood do I actually have? Oh, I've got like 2,500 wood. Or 2,100. Okay, we're good to go. All right. So we'll keep going. Froggy, is were you the person we were on? I think so. Hey, without a table... Yeah, we'll see. Maybe that's uh, maybe that'll help. Despise darkness. Oh, look, we need some light right here. Thank you, Kate, for pointing that out to us. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Am I out of steel? Legit? I'm out of steel? Now, I know that's not true. We've got to have some sitting somewhere. <gasps> no, we're out of it. 
There's none even out here. Oh my gosh, I think this is the first time in the colony's history. And we're legitimately working on some right now, but <clears throat> I think it might be some of the turrets that I've been building. Because we, I did just fill out, yeah, look, we're still waiting on one right here. Still a little bit short. So this entire side now is sniper turrets. So, or precision turrets, I'll call them. Uh, so that's, I think, where all our steel went to. But no worries, we'll get more. Um, you know, at some point, where'd they go? Oh, they're there. At some point, what I need to do, and maybe I just, just go ahead and do it, interrupt our little task of going through the needs tab real quick. And let me look at my mining. Okay. Who is this? Router. Router, you're coming off the growing, bud. You're, you're wonderful at it. You do a good job. But <clears throat> I'm also going to take you off entertaining. And I'm going to make drilling your number one priority. That's good. That's good. Yeah, I don't care about crafting. That'll come last. But that's good. So we've got one person who's going to spend like most of his time on the drill. Let's see. Pilar. Okay. Um, honestly, I think she probably is okay just as she is. is she, well, hold on. Fabrication. Yeah, I don't know why that's a one. But, um, yeah, she's probably okay. I will just go ahead and set this to a two just to be safe there. And let's see. Wolfie, Wolfie. Yeah, you're another good candidate. Let's get you set up on that drill. Honestly, we kind of have a ton of miners, don't we? Like, here's another person. Lynn. Yeah. Okay. Drill, 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 drill. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and build another one of these right here. Yep. We're going to start really focusing in on the deep drills and stuff, which means we do. Okay. I think we're doing okay with these. It's just, we've gotten really unlucky as I think I pointed out just very recently in a previous episode, most of the green patches we've discovered are outside of the compound, but uh, no worries, no worries. So I think we stopped about with Froggy here, roughly. Let's keep looking. I won't spend too much longer doing this. Horrific aging. Oh, this is a person who's the wrong ideology. Can't do anything about it. Pregnancy mood down. What does this mean? Is she pregnant? Okay, yes, yes, yes. This is V, right? Yeah. Should we give her that leg now while she's pregnant? Third trimester? Ooh, I don't know. I don't want it to like coincide with the baby being born. Let's wait. I'll leave it there because it, it probably, I probably won't remember it <laughs> uh, until I notice the bionic laying on the ground. But anyway, let's keep going. I didn't know that the pregnancy gave him a mood debuff. That stinks. I guess third trimester, maybe it is tough. All right, let's see here. We're almost done here. Okay, you're in bed. Wait, hold on. Insulted? Who's insulting you? Happy youngsters. Why is that only? Why is that zero? Is this person a psycho? They must be a psychopath. Yep. <clears throat> Called it. <laughs> All right, let's keep going. We're doing pretty good. Like, I don't think we're, we're not discovering too much. Ah, here's another simple problem. We can do zapper needs a bedroom, uh, a crappy one, at least maybe something like right here. That's terrible though. That's terrible. I'm not going to make them sleep there. We'll give them a bedroom. Oh, actually, how about like right here? This isn't a bad idea. We'll put in... Oh, I'll just do the marble. It doesn't matter. This is what we have the most of, I believe. So let's just do that. I'm going to have to move that light. But we'll do this. I'm also going to remove the floors. Oh, yeah, you better believe it. I'm going to move this light here. And we'll just build one inside too. There we go. All right, that'll be her room. Zapper, I don't know, you male or female zapper? Let me see. Female, that's her. Okay, so get a door there, boom. All right, zapper is taken care of. Let's see, as soon as she gets out of surgery, she's gonna be very, very happy. Okay, on to the next. Table, jealous of Jimmy D's bedroom? Oh, come on. That's nothing. Come on, Wolfie. Uh, oh, this is another different ideology here. So not going to worry about it. A without a table, ideology. Aesthetic has impressive bedroom. Oh, 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 browning. Oh, my gosh. 
I didn't even realize it, buddy. You were ascetic. That uh, was hidden from me. All right, and the children want human meat. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Lynn, calm down, Lynn. Yeah, she's recluse, very crowded. Yeah, not much we can do about that. All right, so that's the end of the list, basically. I'm going to go ahead and set up Browning, another bedroom. I have no idea where. Now I'm starting to reconsider putting this one here, but uh, eh, it's okay. Let me see. I'll figure something out. Okay, well, other than the steel here, which we're still holding on, this is going to be Browning and Zapper's bedrooms right here. And I think they're small enough that they can share a heater. At least I hope so, because we've got a ton of heaters. In these rooms, I decided to just go ahead and put a heater in every one of them. Originally, I was trying to do it, like, real fancy and get them to share. In fact, you can see here I've got these. I should just go ahead and deconstruct all these. Yeah, I don't need these at all. And it would actually give us a little bit of steel, so... Let's give those because you can see I went ahead and just decided to put <laughs> heater in every bedroom. Actually, these don't have them. Wait, I take that back. All right, I will go ahead and put those in there. Now, I'm also realizing these this room's looking a lot better. I think it's ready, actually. Let's see here. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and set this one up. That's great. Got to be marble. Oh, wait, that's the wrong thing. Okay, here it is. There we go. Perfect. Time to get another bedroom up and running. Man, oh man, the Galactic Empire just left us 27 medicine as a gift for uh, visiting us. I tell you what, we have, you know, kept the uh, beds at a zero cost the entire playthrough. But it's, I mean, it's turned out pretty well, even though we're not making silver off our guests, you know, not charging them anything. They're still leaving really good gifts. Uh-oh, well, we've got a grizzly bear hunting Lynn. She's down here. Oh, God, she is melee, too. She's our hussar. Should we let her go at it with him? Oh, man. You know what? Hold on. Let's have a little bit of fun here. What am I looking for? There we go. Inject yourself, woman. There we go. Get over here. It's time to take this bear on. Uh, Let's let it come to us. She's got this burn gauntlet on, too. I don't even know what... Hold on. I got to look it up. Because I don't even know what mod this comes from, to be honest. Sparkling Worlds. Okay, that's a really great mod. In fact, it's got one of my favorite weapons of all time on it. The uh, Bullet Storm. Which we don't have yet. Oh, God. <gasps> She's already... Oh, my God. Oh, no. <gasps> this was a mistake. It was a mistake. Loser's Melee too. Oh, my God. Get over here, loser. I need you, bro. This was a mistake, folks. <gasps> Lynn... No! No, Lynn! Live! Oh, this is terrible. I mean, she's kind of holding her own now, but she stunned it. Come on, Lynn, do something to it. Burn it, burn it! How did it just nail her hand like that? Just It just bit the hand, didn't it? Oh, Lynn! Oh, wow, that was a total mistake. <laughs> Now, honestly, she would have been fine had it not, like, just got, like, I think it got lucky and just bit the hand. But, whew, is she going to survive? Let's see. She's on go juice, so you know she's going to be okay. She's just got to get, hopefully do, she doesn't decide to go, like, play billiards or something instead of go to the hospital. That's always a problem with go juice is they think they're, like, Superman, so they won't go lay down. But she's she's smart. She's playing it safe. Good for you. Okay, well, I've got Defiant working on Lynn, so we should be good to go. I also placed that piece of sterile tile that I had missed, so don't worry about that. Is he wearing a hyperweave duster right now or something? Yes, he is. Very nice. Very nice. I don't think we made that, or maybe we did. I don't No, I bet he picked it up or something. I'm not sure where he got that from, but that's a spiffy-looking outfit. He is one good-looking Chewbacca. All right, how you doing, Lynn? You okay? <laughs> Darn it, we're going to need an arm now. That's okay. Actually, bionic arms are not a bad idea. Let's see. How many? I've got 20 advanced components right now. How many are these? Four. So we can do what? Five? Let's do five. Uh, let's do four. We'll keep a few res uh, <coughs> advanced components in reserve, I think. Oh, you know what? I forgot. I just noticed when I was looking at this table that... Uh, We've already got those advanced components dedicated to something else. The hats, or uh, helmets. We're using helmets. Shoot, 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 shoot. Well, 
We'll still go ahead and make some more, but f we will make some arms. But first, I'm going to have Rico go ahead and make some more advanced components, buddy. We need you on the, the fabrication bench at least until we get a crafting robot. Oh, yeah. Now, this is what I like to see right here. We got three people. There was a fourth just now, but he just walked off and picked up his steel and went to probably take a little break. But this is what we need right here. Oh, yeah. Oh. <gasps> Too deep infestation, of course. <laughs> oh, well, we have to have a little excitement, right? Otherwise, the episode would be boring. Oh, how's how's our girl doing? Lynn, I think she's totally healed. Uh, I mean, obviously, she's missing fingers, but guess what, Lynn? It's time to go fight some in. Oh, she's literally right here. <laughs> okay, never mind, Lynn. Stay where you're at. We're going to go ahead and call up everybody, though. Let's get the whole crew down here. Obviously, this is overkill because these two deep infestations are usually, like, pretty simple, but... We'll just have a little fun with it. We'll get everybody involved. I'll probably make another mess of it like I did with the bear attack, but uh, let's just see how it goes. All right, I think it's, there we go, just about time. I bet you more people get shot by these mini guns than uh, take damage from the insects. Oh yeah, if we look at Browning, I bet it's more. Oh no, the, the bugs did more damage to him. Okay, okay, good shot everybody. Browning, you're gonna be okay? You're, you, you've got death in eight hours, bud. It's time for you to get to the hospital. I think everybody's okay. Browning's probably the worst, but uh, yeah. See, so you bring uh, serious firepower to bear. Those those insects, they can't. They don't stand a chance. All right. So Gizmo just finished another marine helmet. That's like her fourth one. Uh, but uh, she's doing really well. They're not like legendary quality, but hey, she's doing her best. Not being a production specialist, that's okay. I think for this uh, kind of product, for this kind of work, it's satisfactory. So that's very nice, and we you will start to notice more and more people <laughs> wearing them around the colony. So that's awesome. Gizmo still needs one for herself. She's so like uh, fixated on her work; she doesn't even stop, take the time to pick one up and put it on. Go ahead, Gizmo. You can wear one. It's no big deal. Oh my god, the visitors, I just realized, go right through the pile of dead rancors. They just all breathed in that corpse rot. Oh my gosh, you guys, come on. You don't need to walk right through. I guess I positioned it kind of poorly, didn't I? All right, let's move it off to the side. Here's what I'll do. I'll expand it over here. We should probably put it in the water. I think, doesn't it deteriorate away quicker if it's in the water? All right, and I'll shrink it down to over here. <laughs> oh my God! Now just it's that those are gonna have to stay. I'm not gonna have my people move them right now, so those are just gonna stay. But any new stuff we'll put over here. Oh my gosh, we've got a nice little bounty of animals out here, though. I've set up to hunt right in front of the turrets. That's handy. Well, we're still making uh, a little bit of. We are making a little bit of progress on our royalty bedroom and throne room as you can see we don't have a royalty pawn at the moment but i had thought about it and actually wait no we do don't we who was it oh i can't even remember who i set up as the royalty pawn didn't we sell a bunch of gold or give away a bunch of gold i can't select defiant here there we go all right um yeah hold on i gotta go through and figure out who that was again because i'm totally blanking on it oh i should have known it's router Router, router, router. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and give this to router then. Set up. Let's just do that this way. There he is. All right, sign. He's got no lover or anything. We'll set the owner. Router, beautiful. Okay, so how high is he again? I, I think it's just still Yeoman. Wait, what the heck's wrong with V? Oh, third trimester pregnant. She's got a little flashing thing above her. Oh, is it the operation that's on hold, I bet? That's interesting. That's actually really helpful. If the portrait wasn't so tiny, because we have so many people in the colony, it would be much easier to see. I just noticed this too. Um, all right, so we got a few things to take care of here, and we've got a, a room full of guests on top of everything. Look at everybody sitting at the table, so nicely eating their meals. I love it. Although Kate and Haas have to share a space, but that's okay. Well, they do in all four corners too. Uh, I like seeing the table completely full like that though oh look at this caribou revenge like i said it's good that they're in right in front of the turrets i swear i think every single one of those caribou we hunted 
went uh, wild on us. Look at this. We got three of them, and then finally, like the last one, triggered the whole herd. Oh, no. Hannibal. I didn't even see you. Dak, you better get a little closer there, please. Hannibal, how are you doing? Oh, he's going to be fine. If he doesn't get shot by his own friend here. Boy, those little pistols are pretty powerful, aren't they? All right, Deck, get out of here. Hannibal, wait, Deck. least you could do is uh, finish off that uh, deer there, buddy. Oh, my gosh. What a mess. I tell, I tell you, we try and hunt a few caribou, and somebody gets hurt in the process. Okay, well, our strip mining operation has actually turned up some good steel deposits in two locations. One over here and one over here so i'm really happy about that turns out we're not as low on steel as i thought we were but uh yep we're actually getting caught up now too so i think our turrets are all finished that's awesome the heaters for each room are installed and ready to go oh and we've got ourselves a growth moment not to mention a trade ship what should we do first also i laid out flooring over here got rid of uh the dirt and stuff we need to move these i think i don't like them there they belong right here. This is our stockpile zone for the stone chunks. Um, let's see here. Let's take care of the trader, and then we'll focus on the growth moment. Shinobi M1, what's your social? It's, uh, it's middling. Let's get you over here. I don't know how much we'll actually be doing. Wait, where's the farming trader? I didn't see it. Oh, there it is. Right at the top, duh. Yeah, we usually don't do a lot with farming traders, but we'll see. We'll see what they got. Huskies. No, that's us. Pigs. A cow, a nerf, more nerfs, food. Let's see, can we take... Oh, they got a lot of silver. Hold on. I'm going to sell a um, thousand hay, 200 flour. There we go. Um, we'll sell them all our berries, all our agave fruit. Oh, now we're talking. Oh, look, we got a bunch of water. Oh, and their dried watermelons. Look at that. Almost per or the dried fruit. Almost perfect right there. Uh, I've got a heart, but that's okay. I don't care. That's so. That was almost so perfect, I just have to accept it. <laughs> hey, look at this little puppy. What are you doing, puppy? I have a feeling you're in the wrong zone, aren't you? Uh, let's see here. Husky puppy. Barn. Yeah, we got three puppies right here set to hauling. So that's not right. You're not big enough to haul, little guys. Get over there. Okay, that's better. It's good. We are getting uh, quite a few puppies now built up. I guess maybe one day we'll we'll get an Arctic wolf male to join us, but it's not going to be anytime soon. All right, so we now have a growth moment for Typhi. Let's see here. Um, old enough to do the following work. She's seven. Choose a trait. So she doesn't get any um, passions, though. Is that normal? Did I did she not have a, a good growth moment here? I can't remember. Well, we'll choose a trait, and I'll tell you, Iron Willed is awesome. We're going for that. I feel like she didn't have as good of uh, a growth as we normally get, but I think that's probably because she joined us late in her growth cycle. Like, she literally just joined us, right? She's the newest one, I think. But uh, anyway, she's doing okay. We'll, we'll get her trained up. She's going to be doing a lot better. Let me make sure her... Yeah, see, I didn't even set her work schedule yet, so... Yeah, I need to do that and stuff. So let me get that all worked out, guys. But it won't take me too long. And that's probably going to be it for the episode once we get Typhi set up. So I really appreciate everybody joining me today. If you enjoy this content, hit like and subscribe. It really helps me out and I appreciate it. And I will see you guys on the next episode. Hey everybody, thanks for watching, and now check out this fan art by a couple of my Discord members, Finn and Vita. It's pretty good, and I love the cuttlefish.